Hallo, dit is Hans van HGW Design en this video is about the HDMX slider I built for Webflow. So this is not the native Webflow slider, but one I built with HDMX. Why? Yeah, why not? Why not to use uh, new techniques that are available to us and make our life much more easier? So, I built this one, and this video is not about how I built it. That uh, will be maybe in the next video, but this one uh, is about the problems that I encountered when I built it. And I will show you what the main uh, problem was when I click here this little button to change the picture in the slider. You see there's a flash. And that's very annoying. And it took me some time to figure it out what the problem was. And to uh, spare you the time to uh, search for yourself, I made this video for you. So, first we go uh, back to the back end of Webflow and I will show you the settings that uh, causes the flash. Okay, well here on the left, you can see I have uh, the slider, I called it Home Slider 1. It, it contains two diffs, Home Text Block 1 and Home Image Block 1. And inside uh, the Image Block, this is where it happens. I will click this off. <coughs> we have Photo Inside and a Photo. In the setting with the flash, you can see the diff photo inside. That's here because otherwise uh, the slider won't work. You have to put a photo into a diff, otherwise it doesn't work with HDMX. And uh, as you can see, this is completely empty, an empty diff. But the only thing that I uh, did do is give it an uh, ID of basic photo for the swap. And the photo, it has a width 100%, the height of 100%, uh, ratio of square, one by one, and the fit of cover. So when you upload a picture in the future that isn't, has not an aspect ratio of one by one, say 16 by uh, 9, then it will be presented uh, in the web in on the website as a square. Webflow forces it uh, to uh, be a square be shown to you as a square. So with this setting, the photo, with the setting ratio and fit, it flashes. And now when I set the uh, ratio, a oh, little bit wobbly, this to square two, and give it a fit of cover too. Now we go and we go back and it publishes site takes a while it's not too fast this morning okay there we are and now we go back and I refresh the site now when I click you can see the flash is gone and that's the thing that we wanted because flashing is quite annoying Okay, so what you have to do is when you have a photo with, uh, within a diff, please give the diff and the photo inside a ratio and a fit and then the flash is gone. Okay, that's it uh, for this time. Hopefully that was uh, helpful and see you the next time. Okay, bye.